Oh shit! You're right. I gotta I gotta launch that thingy and then push the buttons. All right, all right. Quiet on the set. You're listening to WRFB Radio Free Britannia. And no other freaking better place in the world than Deltona, Florida. Here you are, lunch with no other than the dynamic duo themselves, Laz and Jack. And this is Jack. Welcome to another extremely exciting edition of Lunch with Laz and Jack, where we interpret the news so you don't have to do anything other than question your own personal life choices. And Laz's, definitely not mine. My life choices make everybody laugh. (laughs) No, no. It's fucking Monday, man. It's Monday. Oh, man. And that tweeter versus a rockin'. It, dark blue monkey, I don't drink, so... uh yeah. And if I was off my meds, I'd probably be dead. <laughs> oh, oh, yay. Oh, man. I, I, we're going to be playing. Yeah. Oh, wait. Laz's audio is okay on Jack's stream, not on his own. So, what is wrong with Laz's audio on Laz's stream? Oh. Would would this be the uh the voice synthesizer thing screwing things up? Uh voice mod? Oh, he 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 he's working on it, people. He's working on it. So, you don't want to listen to Laz anyway, sorry. It's not like he really says anything. Exciting. I don't know why he's talking about penis right now. As no one, idea. two. Well, go, go look at a, a 
your mic aux inside of slobs. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the one thing that may cause it is, I don't know. I One, two, there we go. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So what game of marbles are we playing? I don't know. Sorry about that, folks. Is, uh, no, it wasn't 12. that, uh, yeah, my 12. stream labs just went, uh, totally. No, no, no. Wait, wait, that's not. Random. It's, it's quarter lane picking. Random. Totally Pop, random. Skipping a jump on mine, on my side. We're gonna be taking flight on this side. Ooh, excellent. Yeah, I don't usually worry about those settings because those settings usually stick. But uh, it was like some crazy godly gook for my mic. Whereas, uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. That's right. But it is what it is. Red Dragon with a sub. Yeah. 16 months. Thank yeah. you, Red Dragon. Tyrion's meowing at me. Meow, meow. Okay. Meow, meow. Yeah, yeah you like the way I meow at Tyrion. <laughs> meow. <laughs> meow. It's funny. Okay, we're clicking start in three, two, one, start. And Dark Blue Monkey also, or Red Dragon also gets to pick a map. I gotta That's right. What your brother won't listen to. Uh, Do you sometimes illusion into a duck red dragon? Yeah. <laughs> Topic in today's Discord. Uh, oh, in quarter lane with 500 bits. Quarter lane Yay. with 500 bits. Oh, Thank man. you, quarter lane. And to make you feel special, uh, Laz, Heather is at my place right now. Oh, very cool. Yeah, I'll tell I'll tell her you said hi. Absolutely, hi Heather. So so Heather is one of the Hobloth attendees, and uh, if you weren't at Hobloth three, you missed out. Heather of Cove, right? Mm -hmm. That is correct. And Jack's old roommate. That is also correct. That's right. So what is she in town for? Is uh um. Ooh hoo. Tina with yeah. another 300 bits kicking off that high train. Uh, As we go racing, boys and girls. Yeah. And Dark Blue Monkey with 50 bits. Yay. His last 50 bits. Thank you, Dark uh, Blue Monkey. Wait, wait what, what, what am I rubbing in? What, what am I rubbing in? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just wondering if Fradia took your advice the other day. Oh, I have no idea. No <laughs> I don't even know what my advice was the other day for Thradia. It was too early to get up. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Atina is going to get himself a mystery game key. Let's see what we've got for him. And Tina, yeah. do you have a copy of Unto the End? Tell me yes or no. I, I don't know, but Thra Thradia. Um... As Brutus Valdor is out in front. He has that. How about Rebel Galaxy Outlaw? Brutus and Dwips trading paint oh, on each other's and butts. Dwip and Laz all ejected on my side. Right now, Stymie and Quarter Lane duking it out for the, the win. Quarter Lane Who's coming off on the Looks side. Like the Savage Furry. Long live the Savage Furry. Getting some scrolls. Cordelaine trying to hold on to his lead. Can he do it? Can he do it? It's a battle. Dwip takes the lead away. Looks like Dwip is going to steal that lead. And yes. Tina is going to get himself a copy of Rebel Galaxy Outlaw. 
Congratulations, right. Tina. Nice. There's Tina. There's the Tina. Wiener, the wiener is, has received their scrolls. And Laz also has to do a giveaway. I have to real give game. away some scrolls and, then, and do and a game key giveaway. And, and figure out what game of marbles we're playing next. Figure out what the next couple of games of marbles are. But let's uh, get Axe some of his... Uh, well, first off, I guess we're just going to hit a random track if nobody shouted anything out. No one did that I saw. Yeah, I didn't see either. Discussions about rubbing one out. I don't know what they would be talking about. I don't about. know why that would happen. Not here on this show. No clue. But I'm playing Shattered Dreams. As we get X, his scrolls. There you go. Be nice if we had like an auto fill in the mail or something like that. That's for sure. Yeah, yeah. And we're gonna close out a giveaway. Pick ourselves a wiener. A favorites list. And Azorian Dufresne, as the hype train comes down Ooh. to one minute, we hit level two. Man and history would also be phenomenal. Azorian's going to get that copy of Unto the End, then. Congratulations. As we get over to Azorian... So did you do anything exciting this weekend there, Lass? Uh, not really. Oh. Not really. Just another another weekend around the Lass residence. I set some people on fire last night. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Did you get to play Jenga this weekend? Uh <laughs> <laughs> It's a yes, no answer. Don't worry about it. You don't. Uh, we're not going to get into particulars on that one. <laughs> do, do, do you need? <laughs> uh, Ready to click start. We are clicking start in three, two, one. Start. That reminds me. You should see my sinks. <laughs> uh, do I want to ask? I don't know. Well, they're they're cleanish. Oh, okay. Just filled with inanimate objects ah okay it's that's that's pretty much the thought that came to mind <laughs> sitting in the sitting in a water alcohol mix no soap and water <laughs> oh soap and water you don't use alcohol for disinfectant not on that <laughs> i if i want to i can just like throw it in the uh dishwasher and dishwasher the sterilize button <laughs> Dishwasher safe. Ain't nothing better than that. I That's tell right. you what. Yeah. <laughs> it's always funny when you're doing dishes. It's like, what is this? And open the dishwasher. Dishes. Yeah. <clears throat> Too funny. W whenever you come visit again, uh, you should just check out my fr my freezer. Oh, I'm sure I will. We're getting ready for the sprint. <laughs> As we yeah, are headed for, on down the track. It's like, what the fuck is this? Yep. The real question is, where do I hide the bodies? In the freezer in the garage, right? Yeah, well, that, that's got the cow in it. <laughs> and do it, running away with it again. Oh, man. And, and my gopher has dug uh, three more holes in my backyard. Oh, and Tina started playing a new game called Beacon Pines over the weekend. Well, this is just trying to yeah. catch up. is being really hard here, so we're going to watch it this way. Oh. Which map are you playing? The Sprint. Oh, Everybody that's the... Everybody is sprinting. It's just, just the straight track. That's where... right. It's the straight, straight away is Tina. Yeah. And, and then the weird thing is the ten nine eight seven six five four three two one at the very end. 
Okay. Oh, I was ejected. Stymie in the lead again, but Tina takes it over. And Tina, yes, Tina taking the lead. I don't like that track. Oh, and it's Bridge Troll is all in on on uh, New World. He has to unload my soda stuff after Thanksgiving. Oh, good luck with that. Shroudmarketplace.com. Oh, Tina almost got rejected rejected at the very end, but he manages to make it in the basket first. Congratulations to Tina. Da, 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 da. So if you oh, got man. yourself a house in New World, I'm going to say he probably does already. Yeah, so do alms for the poor. <laughs> As we close out the next giveaway, pick ourselves a wiener. And the stymie, long live the stymie. Stymie's going to get himself Yay. a copy of Worms. Worms, the Worms. original. Oh, man. We're, we're going to be doing some probing on my side. I mean, do some probing, huh? We gonna yeah, do some we're playing alien alienated. Probing? Alienated. Yeah, I got okay. some alien probing on my side. Yeah. Everybody ready for the probing? Hopefully everything's Let, all... Let's, uh... let's get Stymie his game key. Congratulations, Stymie. As we reopen that giveaway yeah. and pick ourselves another random track for Monday Madness. Okay, we are. And we're already... playing the Haunted Hammer. The Haunted Hammer. Oh, oh, oh. Anytime you're ready. Clicking start in three, two, one, start. 69 Helps if I click seconds. the join button on my own side, right? Y you would think. <laughs> I almost didn't. It might help. Da, da, da. Yeah. Might help. You don't know. Da, 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 da. But moving right along. Don't forget, exclamation, I love free shit, exclamation, bundle me. Get in for the streamer bundles at the bottom of the hour. And, of course, the next giveaway happening right after this race. And I believe this is going to be the last race for the time. Yes, it is. Yay. Now, are you sure this is the last race? I am. Uh, you, you, you might want to count up your bits and your subscriptions. Yeah, it's the last race. 850 and... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I think you're right. I thought you had one more. We were close. But, oh, that oh, hype train ended, so... We're going to be giving away a copy of... What are we giving away a copy of at the end of the show? Stuff. Odd World Stranger's Wrath HD <clears throat> in addition to our normal giveaways because we got the level two. Yay. Tina, Tina taking the lead. In the lead on both streams. Gotta love that. Rigged. It is. I mean, he must have been polishing his balls all, all weekend. weekend. All yeah. weekend. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The probing is going to happen to both. Oh, Tina and Coeur d'Alene picked up and dropped. Not fully probed. Just delayed a little bit. Last and I slid by Tina. Side. Let's see if I can hold him off. Oh, Coeur d'Alene now in the lead. Brutus in second. As I am now Opposite sides. rimming the hole. <clears throat> oh, oh, oh. As I Everybody get ejected the from the, the hole. Uh, new World, Drip. New World. You can new own a house in New World? It's like... Uh, 
what is it like Red Dead and GTA? They're uh, shared shared properties, as far as I understand. I haven't gotten that far myself yet, but uh, yeah, you can what do you get mean by shared property. It's yeah, the same house, same location for everybody. Yeah, for the most part. Oh, Except, okay. Yeah. So, their so everybody has their own instance of this one individual so house. That that's my understanding. Bridge troll, oh. bridge troll can probably. Uh, Verify that for us. Oh, Quarter Lane missed the basket. Brutus missed the basket. As Tina Looks gets like mixed I'm up in the going paddles. to miss the basket. Laz missed the basket. Stymie probed and ejected by the aliens. He went for the full probing and was launched into outer space. He enjoyed that probing so much. Oh, man. No wieners over on my side. Bridge troll and his flaming bag of poo ejected. Ooh. And Laz, why are you standing up? Uh, because the game is funkadelic. You know how that is. As oh, Tina man. comes in for the win. Yeah, because shroud math. It's, it's been sh uh, shroud mathed. As we get Tina his scrolls. Oh, oh, well, hi there, Lily. Yeah. Did everybody hear that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Lily's like, pet me. I'm going to take over your desk and keep you from using your mouse. <laughs> As we're waiting yeah. on uh, nobody yeah. now. There we go. We're waiting Bridge Troll was a DNF. Know. Closing the giveaway. Picking a winner. Yeah, I was watching this flaming bag of poo coming down the end. And Tina is yet the next winner and let's see uh, what else we have here for tina let's go over to this uh this bundle and deadly 30 deadly 30 i doubt you have this one but uh you know you know how it goes Yes, Lily is really enjoying this today. <laughs> I, it, I I really need to get one of those microphones that like just like jab it into her her, her throat just so that way you can catch all the purring. Just get a little clip on, uh, yeah. You know. Just clip it on her so that way you hear purring and meows. The so bridge troll says, "Just hard to play it after seeing mobs with intellect." Oh, and super, and fast super fast screen loads. screen loads elsewhere. Plus, soda is slave labor. Someone took my money, then forced fans into servitude. Aki. Oh. <laughs> I don't know yep. if they were forced. Uh, you know, that's why they're volunteers. All yeah, Vol but uh, you voluntold to yeah, to, voluntold. Do, to bug report everything. But. Uh, I, I got to admit that New World does have, you know, I, I've been playing New World sporadically. Uh, I did I did jump in after, uh, you know, the big rush and got it on sale for like half price, which is what I like to do. I don't ever buy anything at full price these days because I know they'll eventually go on sale. And uh, yeah, let, let's see what what is New World selling for today? New World. Uh, Thirty nine ninety nine. Yep. It was originally pay for it. It was originally fifty nine ninety nine. Yeah. And uh, you know, I forget That's whether right. I actually bought it or whether that was the one that he conned this. He conned this. Is that what you gave me for Christmas last year? Is that what you, you well, gave? Didn't you 
get something? F- you got, didn't you buy uh, no. it on Prime he, Day or something like that? Yeah, no, he gave me, uh, I know what he gave me. He gave me the uh, one that uh, you were playing, Cyberpunk. Yes, Cyberpunk. And I, I don't think it'll, it'll tell me how much I paid for it, actually. No, no, no. But yes, yeah, so I got it. I got it on Prime Day for like the, I think it was like twenty five dollars. It was like you know, yeah, big discount. I don't know. Let's yes. see. Hey, it, only fifteen of my friends own this game on Steam. Yeah, I don't have that many Steam players. Well, m- Steam most friends. of my, my most of my Steam friends are from Counter Strike. Ah, yeah. But where would I see purchases? Uh, I don't know. That, and most of them are in my uh, 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 can't stop gaming uh, plan. Yes. Da, 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 da. Or yeah, yeah. Most most of my my Steam friends are from uh, uh, CSG servers and Counter Strike Source and Go. Most of it was Counter Strike Source. I say that should show up in my search, right? There it is. New World. Order oh. details. Yeah, it's, I bought it through Amazon, so I can see that. Yes. I can see that. <clears throat> How much did you spend on it? 25 bucks. bucks. 25 <laughs> bucks. Yeah, I got it cheap. Cheap. Was that the deluxe edition for 25 I bl- bucks? I believe it was. Now I got to go back and look again because I didn't actually verify <laughs> that. Uh, yes, the deluxe edition for 25 bucks. So, yes. Uh, the deluxe <clears throat> edition is usually 50 bucks. Yeah. That's so. what it is right now. Half price, yeah, forty nine ninety nine full price for the deluxe, and I got it half price. So that's the that's the kind of price I like on games. But uh, yeah, I, I do think <clears throat> that I am going to have to go replay Neverwinter Nights again, um, or join one of the servers to play online. There is an end game, really. Or you're just hitting level 60 on all your characters, and that's what you call endgame. For what? Uh, bridge troll. Yeah. Yeah, there's never any need to get any of the deluxe games, but you know what? I get them anyway, just to have whatever tchotchkes they throw in with it, because, you know, hey, that's just me. Yeah. That's just me. But uh, let's get to some news here. We got some more feedback uh, from the uh, peanut gallery out here on something that uh, is coming in this Thursday. Don't forget, this is an early release this month and next month, and then we have the long release period between December and January. But uh, Rinaldi doesn't like... uh, one of of the features of the new incoming features. Some emote icon feedback. For many of the emote icons, it is difficult to determine which emote the icon is depicting, mainly because the avatar graphic is too small. Almost one third of the icon is utilized for the curtains, which means the avatar has to be shrunk smaller, making it harder to discern. Shrinking or eliminating the curtains will allow for a larger and more discernible avatar on the icon. Thanks, Lily. (laughs) Okay, fine. I'll go back to petting you. Uh, (laughs) In many cases, the view of the avatar on the icon is zoomed out too far, which makes it difficult, if not impossible, to discern the emote. Isn't that the same thing? I think it would be better to zoom in on the most crucial body part of the emote when possible. This would allow the user to easily discern which emote an icon represents by visual inspection alone. As it stands now, that that was actually Lily hitting the mouse wheel with her tail. 
not <laughs> because my hands were both on Lily. Um, <clears throat> which emote an icon represents by visual inspection alone, as it stands now, I cannot identify many of the emotes without doing a mouse hover over the icon to get the text hint. Here are some examples for which zooming in would be ideal. The eye roll icon can be zoomed in to just show the eyes looking upward. Or you could just take a picture of Laz and Jack and put that on the icon and everybody would know it, especially <laughs> mom. The nose pick icon, and that was Lily again. Uh, nose pick icon can be zoomed in to show only face with a finger in the nose. And and I don't know why they pick their nose with the pinky. I use finger. Yeah, it's the, the classy, yeah. And while oh, while you're taking class. while you're taking a sip of your tea, you can also pick your nose or your pinky uh, if you're good. Yeah. Uh, yes. Oh man! And then after that, and, and Lily scrolled it all the way off. Um, the smile emote can be zoomed in to show only the mouth or the face. Um. Also, many of the icons look nearly the same. See the pic below, for example, uh, making it difficult to distinguish what the icon represents. I think zooming in on the most applicable action or body part will help differentiate the emotes. Why not zoom in on the lips and uh, the saliva projectile for the spit emote? And you really can't see this too well, but let's see if we can open the image in a new tab and uh, get that a little bigger. And and, and control yeah. zoom. Yeah. They, they almost look like the same thing. Yeah, exactly. That's exactly what he's pointing out, is they look pretty identical to each other. Yeah. Well, the, the head's cocked a little bit differently. In yeah, yeah. Minor but difference. Speaking of cocked, we need to cock the trigger on oh, these giveaways. We, we need to pull some streamer bundles. <clears> we need to pull here. something. That's right. Oh, and, and the pulling of the streamer bundle is going to whip. Whip with the double win. Congratulations to double Axe shot in game. I know. His face must be glazed over right now. <laughs> I mean, he, he, he took it from bro both streams at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Scrolls are sent, unless Lily hit the cancel button. I, 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 I hope know. you didn't Look. send scrolls. I mean, sorry, stream her bundle. Yeah. I did do the filter for it. Um, but yes. Devil Cult did respond. Uh, uh, da, 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 da. Hold on. I would say by design, very hard to make 270 egg cons that make a, that is a human action. The main goal here is just to differentiate the icons that the user would like to see. You won't have them all in the bar, but the chance you have spit and yes emote in the same bar is pretty low. No, it's and not. even there, I'm 100% certain you will remember after using it once or twice, if it's the top, or the bottom button when just looking at it. They are tiny, but that's how all our icons are. Also, the reason for adding colored curtains is to help differentiate them even more. You mean like the two red curtains that don't differentiate between either one of these, right? Those yeah. colored curtains, yeah. Yeah. Followed by... Yeah, that's uh, my question there, Tina. Why would they be more unlikely? Uh, no, those those would both probably be in my my bar, you know. Well, the spit and puke would be in both of our. Oh yeah, absolutely. Puke and puke blood, absolutely. 
I'm just hoping they'll give us more than five or ten, you know, slots to put this in. Uh, which 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 window am I on? Slash, puke blood. Which you can't do sitting down anymore. Not you can't do it any sitting you, down anymore. You, you can't do fuck? you can't do ninety percent of the actions you used to. Yeah, I mean, you know, there's so much shit still yeah. broken. It's ridiculous. I mean, oh man. Now, you used to be able to delete coconuts, then you couldn't delete coconuts, and you could delete coconuts, and you couldn't delete Fucking coconuts. Awesome. Yeah, you know, I, I haven't you used been to able to be able oh, wait, to wait. do action sitting down, then you can't do action sitting down, then you can do action uh, sitting down, then you can't do action sitting I, down. I can, I can read a paper and read a book sitting down and, and raise my hand, uh, but I can't. What the? What the f the rock, paper, scissors? Yeah, salute, royal wave, samba. I can't scissor, scissors. Nope, scowl. Oh, scissors. I can. It just took a while for it. I can scowl. Ugh. That's what he should have done. Is scowl and yes. <laughs> Not broken. Working as intended. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, don't think can't so. Take my fist. <laughs> Well, you kids, get off our lawn. Get off our lawn. <laughs> I can do a few of them. Uh, Devil Cult also responding to uh, another bug report uh, from Gwendolyn, which the arrow will be gone in live, as Aliyup said. I got suggested to use the functions, but wasn't aware that there was a bug behind bug. it. It is not a blocking error, so it should be fine for now. And it just appears on QA. You will not see this in live until you see it in live. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Broken as intended. Yeah, that's right, Skeggy. There you go. Broken as intended. Yeah, broken as intended. The modus operandi around here. Fuck it. We'll do it live. That's right. Uh, moving right along. Uh, moving right along. Pick, pick, pick one. These, these are in no particular order today. Let's go with Shroud Math. Shroud Math? Oh, you mean critical or base damage? I'm, I'm guessing critical that's... Critical or <laughs> base damage. I had a funny feeling you'd want to go there. After having been annihilated by white guard skeletons and humiliated by a little dark pony, I'm currently upgrading my equipment while planning what kind of longbow to craft. I stumble over the choices and their meaning. Um, currently, I'm using Easy. a maple longbow plus two. I crafted myself with a durability of 192 out of 218 with damage 8 to 24, critical 5%. Strength bonus very low. Damn parry is five to eight or three to eight damage reduction. <coughs> Excuse me. So how I feel about this. Plus five percent base weapon damage from the maple longbow staff or stave. Um and Dyson. Shh. It's okay. You have to all start somewhere. Plus five percent weapon critical damage. From the two simple leather bowstrings. So when the bonuses come only from the materials being used in the bow, then what does the plus two actually mean or do? Nothing. When I would go for the hard maple timber in my new bow, I would get plus 10% base weapon damage instead of 5% and plus 10% damage reduction. Or when I go rock maple timber, it would be could be plus 10% weapon critical damage and plus 10% damage reduction. I understand that from the stats that all of the attacks, 5% um, are critical attacks, but what does that mean? How much damage does a critical attack do? And would it be razor, better to raise the base damage, which would then raise the critical damage too? Or critical damage then ap would apply only in 5% of attacks? Neither. Neither, because this is Shroud Math. math. Welcome 5%, to Shroud Math. 5% yeah, Critical means that if you hit a critical, if, which is an RNG, 
then you would get a 5% bonus on said crit is the way I in- misinterpret that. Man, that's some seriously fucked up shroud math right there. But that's what it means. Well, at least that's what uh, Bergen's got to say. Yeah, well, Berrigan's got, I personally preferred hard maple with imbued elven bowstrings of speed. Get them from salvaging elven wood- woodwind bows. If you can't get the elven bowstrings, then simple cotton is better. Plus 5% attack speed each. Attack speed corresponds directly to more DPS across the board. The plus weapon critical chance of rock maple doesn't really result in much more DPS. Critical, critical damage is only applied when you score a critical hit. Three. In order of importance, I would rank them like this. Attack speed, damage bonus, critical damage bonus, crit hit chance. Yes. Now, technically, I I would I, actually I would put move. crit hit chance crit. up. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I, I would make crit ch- chance uh, number two. I, I would do crit hit chance one, crit damage bonus two, because the more you're hitting well, for crits, the more damage you're going to get in your bonuses, which means the more well, damage you're going to do across the board. Attack That's speed just, is always going to be more important. Well, I don't know about that. You know, you, I mean, it, it depends on the size of the bonus, really, between uh, again, attack speed bonus yeah. and crit hit chance. If, if, if I'm critting for 200 and your regular, your regular hit is 50, you know, and then I'm getting a plus on top of that 200, you know, I, I can do do more with less. You know, of course, uh, Shroud Math is in play. Yeah. Needs to get that durability down to 30 for more stats. Yeah, he, he hasn't found enchantment yet, apparently, uh, Dyson. Uh, so, uh, you know, he hasn't figured that part out. But moving right along... Um, moving right along. Well, it, as long it, as I have no idea how much critical damage is, I still can't decide if I'd rather have more damage or on less arrows or more arrows with less damage. Yeah, I thought see. that normal arrows without special attacks to be least useful as they very often result in zero damage or of, of glancing attacks. Um, uh, Arrows are cheap, and there are other benefits to attack speed, like more opportunities to interrupt your opponent. There are also more drawbacks, like the faster you shoot, the more aggro you generate. I don't believe Based- that's the case. Well, I mean, that, that would be shroud math aggro tracking. As my understanding is archers just pull more aggro. Uh, uh, For whatever reason more. it is. Well, well yeah. <laughs> Is it, it used to be archers, then magic users, healing, and then you know there was no uh, bard back in the day. So not now, I think it's archers, bards, magic users, healing. But uh, yeah, again, that's you know that needs to be tested, and I just don't have time to mess with shit. Well, like I, mean, the, I mean, how many games that uh, Richard has been involved with where there where there was the concept of a tank and hate generation did he deal with and then what's what's the comparison for uh shroud i don't really? think that i can think of any games that actually had that in it uh, to be honest you with never you. played lineage or lineage 2 i Richard played Richard. lineage but I, I don't remember there being uh lineage an, 2 definitely had it an aggro i didn't again i didn't play it, it like hate. you know hate was the skill and lineage? Hate, huh? Yeah. It's like I hate you. Yes, and and, and Coeur like, yes, lineage two definitely has it. Okay. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Of course, uh, <laughs> I played the most useless class in lineage because uh, I'm a masochist when it comes to playing games at times, not in real life, but yes. I, I yeah, Skeggy, like, archery is uh, usually a good DPS uh, build if you do it right. Warsmith. And find you a damn rock to get up on so you don't get aggro. Uh, yeah, no, because um, if you recall, what's up, Zeke? Is, uh, Chris took the, the, the high elevation thing it, out. 
he 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 narfed that after people were exploiting it out in one of the uh the uh what's the word I'm looking for? Yeah, Control I know points. He nerfed, I know he nerfed it, but the, there's still places that you can get. I mean, you just got to explore the scene a little bit. You'll find a little nook and cranny here and there and scene. Yeah, but uh, you, you you might be able to get the elevation. He took the damage out, is uh, our understanding, when he, he made the announcement. Well, you know, you well, guys he, are shooting from up there, so I had to modify it so it didn't do as much damage. And, yeah, you know, it's like, I, well, then... I, I cr this these things are exploits and not working as intended when yeah. they're really working as intended. I I, cre I but, created uh, the system to work this way, but I don't like the way you're all using the system I created, so I'm calling it an exploit. Yeah. Yeah. But what's up, Zeke? What are you doing? You finished building that fence? Shit, no. I'm freezing my ass off. <laughs> Fucking cold outside. I don't know. It's 79 degrees and sunny here. I may go swimming today. Uh, no, he nerfed it because he kept dying in PvP because he doesn't play the game. <laughs> yeah, well, when, when you test your combat archery against three immobile dummies and then you say it's working as intended, yeah, that's, yeah. Because we know that's how he tested the system was against three dummies out in the GM area, and he didn't never tested them against moving targets in the real world. That shroud, baby. That shroud, absolutely. Or if he did test it against a, a mob, he was god mode uh, with 200 of every skill. Most likely. Yeah. And so it's like, it doesn't matter what you're doing. Um, and I still like your idea where people should be able to adjust their stats out in QA just to test everything. Absolutely. They should be able to. It's yeah. like... <clears throat> Able to uh, up and down the stats to see what what your best best build is through, across the board, and uh, you know it won't affect anything on the live server because you know at least it'll give you an idea of what you want to work towards. I mean, it only takes ten minutes to GM something if you have enough experience and a potion and a trainer, but uh, you know that's all you know, besides itself. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um. Yes. And then lastly, Vantorian's like, since this question wasn't answered already, the plus two doesn't have any effect as far as I know. Yep, is there is here. a rough, rough indicator of the item's level. The number is increased by adding properties via exceptional crafting materials, masterwork, and enchantment. Different enhancements can increase it by different amounts. And failed attempts at Master working and enchanting can decrease it. So, in my opinion, it doesn't really provide useful information. You're better off looking at the actual properties. I would uh, tend to agree. And F. Bowler coming back with, all I can say is crit damage will always trump base damage, even if the it's the same percent. I did all the testing. No other material is good as rock maple. For the strings, I prefer, personally prefer imbued elven strings of speed, but it's really up to your play style. Never looked back since I first texted the rock maple crossbow against every other combination. General suggestion for archers. Crossbows will always trump bows, unfortunately because I love how long bows look. Yeah, crossbows ac actually hit further than regular longbows and that's been tested by myself that much i know is a crossbow will shoot further shoot faster uh I, not shoot necessarily faster. faster i don't think we we saw much of a speed difference uh especially when using uh the skill uh what is the skill i'm thinking of multi-shot uh multi-shot yeah is it multi-shot where it sends like 10 arrows out uh range is that what it is Aim shot, piercing shot, rapid fire, rapid fire. Yeah, because oh, wait, multi shot is the is five at once. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. It's a three at once, whatever it is. But uh, <laughs> yeah, rapid it, fire is the ra- 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 rapid fire is the way to go because uh, I don't care about your speed bonus. Yeah, you plunk in a whole bunch of arrows, boom, 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 into your enemy. A lot of times you can really knock them down quite a bit uh, using that rapid shot. Yeah. Thank you, Prankster. Absolutely. Yeah. And, and coworker just sent me or, an image that says, Mommy, will you marry my daddy? And I'm just laughing because some people have a different interpretation of that. But the shirt was on our kid. Um, <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, crit damage is the only way to go to do big DPS as an archer. If you want good DPS boot, crit damage as much as possible. Uh, don't bother too much about crit chance. Uh, it will naturally come as dex increases with skills and gear. Prefer base damage over it. Uh, then after that, Hit me up in game if you want to see some examples. Ulrich Hildegard. <clears throat> and then, it, then then there's the uh okay. How to craft a bow. So yeah, crit damage. So yeah, like I said, I, I, I would I would have gone yeah, you know, uh again the crit crit what it was the original uh for speed. Crit hit chance over the damage, absolutely. So definitely, uh, I gotta agree with uh, F Bowler here. Uh, and again, the other stuff comes. It, 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 someone that's done the math for you, you might as well just listen to them. Yeah, that reminds yeah. me. What kind of crossbow do I use? Now, yeah, we got you got to we got to keep reading here because uh, it, it, it's some contradictions against what you just said. Is there more? Oh yeah, refresh is. Okay. <clears throat> Never thought about a crossbow for a ranger. Our crossbow is not implemented as being much slower to fire than a bow in real life, including using a slow crank to lo- reload a heavy crossbow that would compete with longbow in range. Ha! Welcome to Shroud Math, because... <clears throat> have you ever also noticed that, like, a dagger and a sword swing at the same speed, too? They also pretty much hit at the same range. Yeah. <clears throat> In this game, crossbows are very slightly slower to fire than very longbows. slightly slower. Very, very slightly slower. Slightly yeah. slower. <laughs> that the speed Fucking buffer only, only affects auto slash free attack, but they have much longer range. The difference you get in material bonus makes them up for all the small speed difference. And hi ho, hi ho, Gia, Gia. Gia Tarag. Hello, but yes, I guess I need to craft my own crossbow for the first time, and then see if I can out damage perform everybody. Yeah, well, one thing I don't do is. Uh... Make my Craft. own equipment, yeah, because yeah, uh, yeah. I can all my, find all my much, equipment is freebies. I I can find much better equipment made by some master crafters out there in the game, and uh, can always place orders through the guild from some of those guys. Used used to be, uh, oh, hold on, what happened just there? That's I just a, that's a dragon. It's a pot, tiny one. It's probably only got like fifty hit points. Holy crap! Because I thought I just like went right through the. Yeah. Uh, uh, Where the hell did he come from? Uh, uh, Zeke You're playing welcome. with a pot. Huh? Zeke playing with a GM pot. Oh. It's only got 23,000 hit points. What are you doing with those? You're not supposed to have those. Maybe he asked Chris for them and Chris gave them to him. Yeah, but there are rules governing what the use of these are. 
Well, if they ever fuck actually the enforced those yeah, rules, nobody the rules. would have them anymore. Because <laughs> how many it, people it, do you know that have violated all those rules? Yeah. Me, meanwhile, I get yelled at for you know posting you know, in different uh, yeah chats, yeah, but yeah, yeah. People, people can exploit yeah exploit the rules and not get yelled at. Yeah. But that is. Uh, that's a big sucker. I, I can barely yeah, see what's it, going on here. Yeah. It's a big dragon. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah well, I mean, remember, if Chris enforced his own rules, he would ban himself from the game. Yeah, absolutely. So. <clears throat> but yes, remember, Chris has returned to the Portnip uh, dev team almost on a full-time not not rate. quite yet as we we discussed on friday I, almost almost he still has vacations and other things to do that will full-time ish almost full-time so i mean three four hours a month of work is close to full-time it's 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 almost full-time now now <laughs> but anyway, moving right along. Yes, if you're uh, looking for a good range weapon, crossbows are the way to go. Um, they have more power, they have more range, and I don't care about the uh, very slightly slower because I really don't think that that's a... Uh, Oh, there we go. Chat just disconnected. That's nice. Uh, just chatty. Just chatty. Yeah. Work Same. is such a strong word. Yes. Yes, he's got to take a vacation before the holidays. Got to take a vacation before the nerf and after the nerf. There you go. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I, I went with Archer uh, after seeing Jack's results and then... I spoke to a few other people, and Archer was the way to go, even though I wanted to play a mage. And, uh, you know, Archer, Mage, Tamer seems to be the uh, the main way to really go, have a really good, powerful pet out there with you well, that will take care so, of stuff. So I just but, tested it. Uh, no damage from on top of your wall. Yeah, well, again, you, I don't think you were really elevated above the dragon at that point either. But yeah, as uh, again, as we know, he took that out because he didn't like people using what he put in. You know, he built a whole skill set based around, well, you'll do more damage of shooting down on something and less damage while shooting up at something. But I didn't like that, so I'm taking it away from you after spending... Too, too, too many people found you can perch on top of a rock and just kill shit because... Instead uh -huh. of fixing spawn timers and doing or the things that we talked about fi fixing early on in the development of, of those game. items, yeah. yeah. Did you get all that shit on film? No. It doesn't matter. Like anything that's said, is it going to be real? Like how many times did they say, we're never going to do this? The ability to hide a helmet is fucking stupid. If you don't want a helmet shown on your character, don't wear one. They said that for years. Then what did they implement? Hiding your helmets. So now people who are walking around with actual helmets on, when you try and size them up, you can't really do it because they're hidden. Yeah, <laughs> just silly stuff like that. A anything they say they're not going to do, they'll eventually they'll, do. So. They'll do it eventually, yeah. If they say they're going to do it, Good luck waiting. Then you'll be waiting for you know ten years for episode five because what are we like? No, 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 no. Four years ten in years. on episode two. We, well, we still have another six years for episode two before that launches. Oh, uh, you think? <laughs> yeah, or, or they just jump to episode five when episode two's done and just say we're done. Yeah. Well, but, that, that uh, would have them do a bunch of additional land masses and they would have to create some scenes. And uh, I, I, I I, think you could. Or are they it, just going to do the, the land masses and then just put player owned towns out there? Yeah. Here's a land mass. Here's a scene. Episode <laughs> yeah. four. Yeah. And we're being facetious we, about we, this. Without, a, without any quests or anything yes. like that. 
Yeah, meanwhile, we're still charging, what, 20 bucks a pop for episode 2 access? Yep. But, but you, you know, know what time, time it is? is? Yeah, look at that. It's great minds think alike. It's that time oh, for man. us to uh, pose out yeah. the final giveaways <clears throat> of the day. The stymie, the savage furry, getting some more streamer bundles for me. Cordelaine oh. is the winner of the streamer bundle. Congratulations, Cordelaine. You're gonna get you're gonna get yourself some glass bottles. Or and whatever then, whatever it is that you usually get when you get streamer bundles, unlike mom who gets oh. mostly glass bottles. And let's see. Box try getting a copy of Monsters and Mon uh, I'm sorry, Monkeys and Monsters double pack. Monkeys and Monsters? Oh, interesting. Double I don't, pack. I don't yeah. think I saw that one. Oh man. Uh yeah, it's got Don't Feed the Monkeys and I Am ah, Not okay. a Monster. Yeah, okay. I did see that. Okay. Yeah. I didn't think it was worth it, but that's just me. Yeah. And then we're going to be pulling two giveaways here today, the end of stream giveaway, and then the uh, pipe train giveaway, which is going to be a copy of Odd World, The Stranger's Wrath HD, worth $9.99. Oh, you know what? I never opened up that giveaway, so you all better get in there really quick. I love free shit really quick as we wrap things up here today. Become an archer like everybody else in Trout of the Avatar because all the other builds are dead. They're like dead, Jim. <laughs> okay, and I got to go because I got a meeting starting. So I will talk to you all later. All right, so Good Jack boy. is out of here. We'll see you later, Jack. As everybody gets in on the giveaways, I guess I should just drop that. And I'll give you all just another second. All right, closing the giveaways. And Tina is the winner of our first game key. And Tina is going to get himself a copy of... Darkness Within 2, The Dark Lineage. And our hype train winner who's getting a copy of Odd World is going to be Super Drop Forever. Super Drop Forever getting Odd World, Stranger's Wrath HD. Congratulations to our winners and thank you all for your support. We love you guys and gals, and uh, without all you folks, we wouldn't be here for over eight years doing this five days a week, and we love you all. So we'll be back with more tomorrow right here on NBNN. Until then, I'm Les. Jack had to go take a real-life meeting, and we are NBNN. Uh, Tina's already got that one. I'll talk to you after the show, Tina. Have a great day, everybody. We'll see you all tomorrow.